Still on pension matters, pensioners have been advised to moderate their food intakes, engage in physical exercise and live a healthy lifestyle in order to stay safe. The pensioners were charged to stay away from away, stay away from sugary foods and drinks which periodically seems them to diabetics. Correspondent Gabriel Odia sends the report. The Medical Women Association of Nigeria, Benue State Chapter, gave the charge while collaborating with Nigerian Union of Pensioners in Makadi to sensitize them on the dangers and the need to adopt a healthy lifestyle. Some of the pensioners thanked the organizers while they lament inability to buy drugs due to the state government's failure to pay them. See the turn up. It's very impressive. But if the government is treating us fine, you would have seen more people in attendance here. So the exercise is helping us. Here they treat us free. We don't pay anything. Even though, because I've been living with diabetes for many years, a lot of things that I've said here are not new to me. Well, I take the medication, I go by what doctors tell me to do. Like I don't take alcohol. I don't eat meat, I don't, a lot of things. Well, I'm a pensioner, but uh, I, I'm not having diabetes. Only hungry is always worrying me because my pension is not paying as I when due. I retired in 2014, but up to now, my gratuity has not been paid. Our pension has been paid last. December 2009. A consulted family physician who sensitized them said about 7 in 10 persons above 70 years are diabetic globally, but in Nigeria, about 3 to 5 percent of adults above 40 years of age per 100 persons would be diabetic. A situation she said pensioners who are elderly need to be educated on. So we are celebrating World Diabetes Day. World Diabetes Day is celebrated everywhere in the world on the 14th of November. But we are doing it today because that is the meeting day of the pensioners. And we are doing it with the pensioners because in most places it is a disease of middle age and elderly people. That is people that are over 40 years. Diabetes can be symptomless. You may not notice anything. And that is why we say when you reach 30 years, come for screening. Come up for screening. You don't need to, be, to have a symptom before you go to the hospital to screen. You may not have any symptom. It's a silent killer. Meanwhile, the Chairman Medical Women Association of Nigeria, Dr. Toriang Benhame, and counterpart from the NMA, who led the team, said effort is aimed at helping senior citizens in line with World Diabetic Day. Over 200 pensioners benefited from the exercise. Are focusing our outreach today on the theme which is access to diabetic care and we want to um, give the pensioners who are here the education they need on um, risk factors, symptoms uh, for diabetes, how to access care if you are diagnosed with um, diabetes or how to get yourself screened. That, um, it's a good, uh, it's a good uh, group of people to start with so that we can help them get these drugs and encourage them to adhere to their drugs. Yep. Uh, we're working together with them so that we can ensure that uh, this exercise is not just a one-off exercise, but periodically, we've done it before, uh, we'll keep doing it.